Um, taking the fam, taking Chia, hey, what's up, baby? Taking uh, Chia and her parents to Universal City, Universal Studios. Gonna ride some rides. Um, yeah. Yeah, are you excited, babe? Excited. Babe, uh, so uh, now that our parents have met and they get along, what's next for us, huh? You tell me. <laughs> What's our next move? I don't know. That's up to you. You gonna propose or what? You gonna put a ring? You gonna put a ring on this? Put a ring on this? You gonna put a pinky ring on me? You gonna lace me up? Thirty <laughs> k, babe. Thirty k on my pinky. So it is five o'clock. It's five o'clock in the morning. The conversation got boring, and um, uh, I, uh, Chia is actually gonna be at my spot with her fam for a few more days, chilling. I was supposed to be there with them. Oh, you are gonna stay. You're gonna stay in in in. Hold on, the lane. Departing flights, babe, to the right. Um, I'm actually flying. I was hit up. Uh, by uh, some MTV people to shoot something in Philadelphia this weekend. That's MTV One, y'all. Not just MTV Two anymore. Your boy done moved up. And uh, so, unfortunately, that means I gotta cut the family trip off early. But you understand, right, babe? Yeah. Yeah. It's all in a day's work. You know what I'm saying? I'm just trying to provide for our future family, baby. Hey, your head is in the, the departing, way. Departing, departing flight. <laughs> And uh, my head is not in the way. I can't see in the mirror. Oh my god, okay. So, um, she's taking to the airport. I'm about to fly to Philadelphia. But then, I'm going to fly to Canada after I go to Philadelphia. Don't tell Chia. Uh, the, the jig's up, The babe. jig is up. Chia, what? And, uh... Where am I going? <laughs> you are just going to stay here. I don't know which terminal U.S. Airways is. Um... Yeah, babe, like you little pro out here. She's been driving out here all by herself, guys. Out in so these, good. these LA streets. Babe, you're a pro. You ready cool. to move out here, huh? Cool. 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 I'm here in Philadelphia and I'm on set for this thing I'm shooting. It's kind of secretive right now. Um, but check it out, I'm in my own trailer. What's good? I mean, it's not a big one, but it's pretty, you know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, so I'm out here, I'm in my trailer, I'm chilling, I'm just waiting to, uh, to go through wardrobe and figure out when we're gonna be rehearsing and all that shit. They're getting me food. I got my own private bathroom, I'm finna jack off in y'all. All right, y'all, so I'm out here on the set of this MTV thing we're doing. It's like a, a, a game show thing for Maze Runner, right? Uh, she's hosting. Hi, who are you? Say what's Hi, up. I'm Zuri Hall. <laughs> what's up? What up? Uh, and I'm co-hosting, right? We are here. It's, 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 it's a maze in the... Oh, hi. Hi. <laughs> it's, it's a maze in the middle of a prison out here in Philadelphia. Um, shit's haunted. It's crazy. I was chilling in my trailer, and uh, it was like a ghost dick in my ear. Wow. I felt it. It was crazy. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> okay, so where where are we at right now? Eastern State Penitentiary. Eastern State Penitentiary. Um, I'm just waiting on my turn to do my part. Uh, we got the Maze Runner logo back there, um, and uh, yeah, man, there's my there's my little mark. I'm just waiting, bro. Standing around waiting for my part. What's up, man? How's it going? Hey, man. hey. and uh, <laughs> rocking it. You know, we out here. It's haunted. Ghost dick. <laughs> <laughs> She's scared of the ghost dick. All right, Zuri. What up? Zuri, 
what's up? What, 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 what is this? What's going on behind me Listen, right now? Listen, we got a million dollars on the line. Maze Runner competition special. Oh my God. They're walking away with like two scions, Tim. One two, for me, one for you is two basically science. what this comes down to. Man, let's just snatch them up. Not really. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so that's crazy. We got all our contestants up there on the stage earlier. It's about to go down. It's about it's to go down. A little cray cray. A little cray. Yes. What up, bitch? Guess what? It is 7 a.m. and I just got back to the hotel room because we just wrapped like 20 minutes ago. Woo! It's all good though. I'm tired. I'm not even tired. You know what? I feel good. I feel good. That was my first ever thing I ever shot with MTV, the original MTV, not MTV2. I feel good, man. I feel great. Getting paid in this swanky, comfy ass hotel bed. Oh, yes! <sighs> Take a little nap, pack my bags, and then go see Chi in Canada. Aww. One knockout, let me just say. I was low-key nervous, man, when we first started shooting, but like, um, this old white dude came up to me and was like, you're great, great energy, you're great. And I was like, thank you. That, that helped calm my nerves a little bit, you know what I'm saying? And then after we got done, when we wrapped, another older white dude, white dude, I don't know, it might have been the same guy, I was sleepy. Old white guys all kind of look alike to me. And <laughs> he just came up to me and he was like, he was like, hey, you did, you did awesome. You know what? You're, you're going places. You're good luck, uh, good energy. And I was like, thank you, old white man. I appreciate that. You know, I'm not going to lie, man. A compliment from an old white dude who's been in the business with shit it is it feels good it's a nice i'm already a confident dude but it was a nice little boost of confidence it's always nice to have somebody who's been doing it to reaffirm you and reassure you and you know and let me know that i'm doing good you know so thank you old white man i love you i appreciate you now give me my money you honky mother and no, i'm just playing <laughs> for it um <laughs> And I ran into, hi, who are you? Hi, Josefina. <laughs> and you're a fan, from from where? From Spain, Madrid. Cool. You watch me in Spain? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> you're famous. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, get in here, girl. Hi. hi. <laughs> Bro, tell me why I didn't bring any socks, right? Because I didn't have no clean socks back at the house. And I was like, I'll just buy socks when I get back. Um, to the hotel room in Philadelphia, but I was working the whole time. I didn't have time to buy socks. So I'm wearing yesterday's gross, disgusting, dirty socks right now, dude. I'm so grossed out. And I was walking around the airport trying to find regular socks to wear, but nobody has regular socks. So I gotta, I had to buy these. Uh, it's my only option, these Barney socks right now. So, but it's, I'd rather rock these and be funky and gross feeling, man. Okay, not gonna lie, bro. These shits are comfortable. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So what's up, y'all? Here I am, back in Canada, back in Chia's spot, back in Chia's bed. But nigga, you know what I'm saying? Giving us something special to come home to. You know what I'm saying? No, I'm not naked. I got drawers on. No, I had to cut the the family trip short so I could get some work done. So we figure, you know, how about I just afterwards I just flew in um to spend a few more days with her. She's actually not even here yet. Like her and her fam flew out from my spot earlier today. They're not back yet. So I'm just chilling, waiting, getting my man funk all over her sheets, so that way she can she can smell me in her sheets when I'm not here, you know. Just give her something to cuddle up with his pillow and just be like, mm, Tim, mm. oh, wait, what's that smell? That don't smell like that don't smell like me. I don't wear Axe body spray. Chia got some splaining to do. So the Million Dollar Maze Runner special airs Sunday at 11 p.m. on MTV. Make sure y'all tune in. It's my first MTV gig, so hopefully if I do well and the ratings do well, then they'll hit me up for more stuff, you know? You know me, man. Always working, always grinding. One job at a time, one day at a time, one opportunity at a time, one door at a time. I'm breaking them motherfuckers down. The royal penis is clean, your highness. Thank you. King shit.